That's an interesting theory. <laughs> and one I, you know, I hope you don't explore too much, because, uh, what is it, Sandy? Sandy, you know, Caleb and I have been friends for many years. And if I were to sit down with the DA, there's no telling what we might talk about. Let me see, I, uh, I had an assignment for you. Uh, let, me, uh, let me think here. <laughs> Yes, sir. Yes, George. I want you to make this project a top priority. I will, sir. Top priority. Top priority. Top priority. <laughs> now, I know you two aren't having an easy time of it right now. Me, I wouldn't wish parenthood on my worst enemy. But I wish you both luck. You're always in my prayers. Good night, Daddy. Oh. Good night, Rosebud. Good night, Harold. I haven't even had a chance to look at this. I don't even know what the hell it's all about. Oh, sorry, Your Honor. Uh, I just assumed you had read... Are you accusing me of being unprepared? Uh, no. You're the, uh, student, right? Yes, sir. Your Honor. Piece of advice. Don't piss off the judge. Oh, I didn't know you had to leave so soon, dear. Chief Mannion. My name is Sam Sheridan. I came to turn myself in. What'd you do, Mr. Sheridan? I shot the priest. <laughs> You're good, huh? <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> you lousy little shit stain. You sniveling piece of shit! You think I'm gonna let somebody like you blackmail me? <laughs> Your first engineer to want a broken. And you'll ne'er be green a coal wind with your bath sweep. Uh, in layman's terms, how bad is she? She's a total pig. If I see politics in your future, sir, perhaps a run at the Oval Office. Well, you know I've never given that a serious consideration. Well, wait, good. General, he faked it. Major, you are the most insubordinate officer I have ever met. How many times have I told you boys to be quiet? Now, your father, he has to work in the morning. You know that. I figured if I could change that one moment, I could change it all. I could have been the father. I never was. The husband I should have been. We could have been a family. God damn it, DeYoung. I'm tired of hearing what you can't do. I want to know what you can do. Our only other choice is to try to scram the plant. Scram the son of a bitch. There's nothing in the world like shooting a water cold 50. You squeeze the trigger, and she spits out a stream of red traces. <laughs> Empty cabbages fly everywhere. You mean cartridges? Them too. What is sex, after all? Two clunky old bodies thrashing around against each other. You get all sweaty and flushed. The hair gets mussed. You lose your breath. You lose your earring. Your mouth waters. Your nose runs. Your heart races. Your blood races. Rose. Say it, Ernie. It's time, Rose. Check, please.